Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and today we're gonna hopefully get a kingdom addicted to my delicious potions in a game called Potion Craft. Now, this game is not out yet. I got a preview build from the developers, and I just wanted to show it to you guys because it looks so damn good. You guys know I love my indie games, especially indie games where you run a shop. And that's exactly what we do in this game. We run this old man's shop because he's too good for it now. I am ready, master. Uh, I've already read everything, by the way, so don't freak out. Anyways, in this game, we have to build potions for people to help them out. For example, this guy burned his tongue on some hot soup and he can't taste anything more anymore. That's not a good thing when he's a brewer. So we need to build a product that can heal his tongue. So how we do that is basically we explore the map with our herbs of goodness. Now, how do you get the herbs, you ask? Well, you grow them, of course, in your garden. Those are interesting looking. <laughs> but yes, we get new herbs in our garden every day. Also, merchants come from time to time that we can buy herbs from. And we have to utilize these herbs to explore. Explore how, you ask? Well, we have a cauldron of doom here. We also have a pestle and mortar here. And we can uh, use our mortar to pestle our pestle. Wait, is it the other way around? I don't know. It doesn't matter anymore. We also have a dippy thing. The dippy thing dilutes our potion. We'll get more into that later. And we have have a blower, a bellows, if you will, which will heat up our product. Also, in the basement, that's where the real good stuff happens. That's where we make our drugs. Just kidding, this is our alchemist lab. We'll get more into this as we go about this, but basically, we're trying to build the best alchemist potion possible. I actually don't know what we're doing because I was never able to do it, but maybe if we become a professional potion maker today, we can actually get this done. So yeah, each vial has to be filled with a certain amount of potions, and yes, we'll get into that in a little bit. I guess the one thing I didn't show is where the magic happens, the bedroom. Not much magic happens in the bedroom in this game. That more happens downstairs, uh, but that's where we sleep and end our day after we have delivered all our potions to these wonderful people. So yes, we have to find a health potion right now. Now, you might be looking at this and saying, how the hell do we do that? Well, each herb makes our potion go a certain direction. And as you explore, you'll unlock different things that you can unlock. Um, so for example, we can put this in here. Smashy smash it because we want to get as far as possible. And you can see that's where the X goes. Throw that in the cauldron get 10 points. Oh, dude, skills. And away we go! And now these things that we're getting right now are XP. Those are the no-no zones. If you go into the skull and bones, you kill everybody in the kingdom. No, I'm just kidding. Your, your potion is ruined. So we do not want to ruin potions because we only have a certain amount of herbs. So I'm just going to explore for the start here. Ah, that's what I want to define. Something that gives me something. So what we're gonna you do is use our phalatic mushroom and well actually we don't even need to really well we can we can we can actually crush it because we're not gonna go all the way. And what I mean by that is you'll see in a second here. So we'll slowly stir ever so slightly. Now you can see the one. One is a low number, obviously. We want two or threes, damn it. So what we're gonna do is just twiddle our stick a little bit and then get it over here. Now, the big thing is this dipper. This dilutes your potion. Any dilution goes back to the middle of the map. So you can actually see the arrow there to kind of aim this up. We're definitely a little high, so we're just gonna twiddle this a little bit more. I'm thinking that's, that's good. Okay, so now we're just going to slowly dilute our potion, and that brings the whole thing back to the middle. And I screwed it up, didn't I? Okay, hold on, it's okay, it's okay. We didn't royally screw it up yet. Uh, you see see what I mean? You gotta have it like right in the freaking middle, man. I might not I might not even get a three here. I hope I do. I'm not the best potion maker, but I know what I'm doing, damn it. There we go. Blow it! And now we have a sun potion, or sorry, a potion of light, and it's a three star. So you can save recipes now, so you don't have to do that every time. As long as you have the herbs, it will do it again. So I'm going to save that recipe in case we need light potions. Let's just explore a little bit right now. So we got some water bloom. So I'm going to go this way because there's XP this way. And actually, before we go too far too, let's upgrade ourselves. So we can do haggling, trading. Those are for obviously prices. Recipe book is for saving more recipes. And then visibility is what we really want want right now because I'm exploring a little bit. Okay, did that unlock anything? Can I see anything? Not really, just XP. So let's go this way still and see what we can find over here. Oh, actually, we have one right down below. Perfect. We're gonna head down that way and see what this possibly is. Health has to be close. Health is gonna be a common potion. So I'm hoping it's nice and close and it's this one. That would be fantastic. Now, do I want to try and get a three or should I just accept a one? I think for right now, we, we won't save this. I just want to see what the hell this is. And of course, it's the health. Okay, I probably should have tried to go for a three, but that's okay. We'll finish potion. 
And we'll sell a crappy potion to this guy, because he looks shady anyways. So here you go, good sir. Here is your potion. I get 11 gold for that piece of crap. Okay, so let's try and haggle. Now, the haggling in this game is a little stressful. Basically, you have to combine these together, but as you can see at the bottom, it counts down too. So haggling is extremely difficult. That went way too well, so I'm going to accept that at 13, and bam. There we go, we had our first good sale. I love that this guy looks like my red mushrooms. <laughs> okay, there's one. Maybe we can get three right here, two. I have to be very careful here. We might only get a two with this. I feel like it's three worthy. Okay, yes! All right, blow it, baby! There we go, we got a strong healing potion. All right, and we're just gonna grab this XP because we have a herb that can get us down here and nothing else was unlocked, unfortunately. Okay, strong healing potion. That's a boring name. Let's go for super awesome potion of healing. I promise it's totally not addictive. God, you can keep going. A sub to Dre. I, I am running out of ideas. I didn't expect to have a name this long. Please, thanks, does this. Okay, there we go. We, we hit the limit, guys. Okay, we can also have a description. So, oh God, this can probably, this can go longer. Oh no. So you know what we're gonna do with the description? We're gonna put the script to Shrek. It didn't go as long as I expected. <laughs> we have the introduction. <laughs> All right, Mushroom Head, here you go, buddy. $27, no, we, we must go higher. That's a three-star potion, dude. Damn it, I missed my haggle. If you miss your haggles, you royally screw up in this game. You have to hit them or you're dead. Okay, that was pretty damn good if I do say so myself. $32, baby. All right, this lady has a mice problem, but her cat doesn't do anything but lie on the cabinets. Typical cat, so we gotta find some sort of poison, obviously. So let's do some exploring here. Okay, do I want to try and get a better deal? Yeah, you know what with this one We might actually be able to do it So we should at least be able to get a two and I do want to try and get that XP over there obviously so and Come on give me three three, please. It's not happening. It is not happening. Okay. Let's just accept two Damn it. See you got to be perfect with the damn threes, but we should be able to get this and should I explore a bit, being that we're down here? Is there anything that can go far down to the left? I don't think I have anything. So you know what? We're not gonna waste our herbs if we don't need to, but that was poison. Didn't we need poison? Let's just call it not poison to really confuse the customers. Here you go. Oh, that worked out. Okay, I'm so glad we found the poison right away. So I don't know if you noticed, but these get smaller every time, so you don't want to get too cocky unless you're like a professional at this. That's pretty damn good. I am, I am on point today. Female Link is here. This is actually a trader. So I have 172 gold coins right now. And she has, ooh, thorn stick looks so good. So I'm thinking these prices mean that she's asking a lot for this though. But that seems like such a useful thing, especially when we're exploring. Definitely getting the terraria. Holy crap, two each. Let's go crazy. I, I want all the terraria because that is a good price and we can use a lot of terraria. Wind bloom goes down south. Um, so that's overpriced right now, but I'm gonna hopefully haggle and be successful. Let's try it. Oh, oh, oh God, it's going up so quick. Maybe I should have upgraded my freaking haggling before I did this. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna accept that. 173, is that what I started with? I love how I'm one away. One away! All right, so we're gonna get rid of, um, I don't think I'm gonna need 32 Terraria, so let's just drop that. Wait, what? Why is it 227 now? Oh, if I change it, it goes way up? Please tell me, please tell me. Can I, can I, can I, can I redo this? So I can't haggle this time, so I guess we won't go crazy. But yeah, if you haggle and then ch change your deal, I guess she gets angry? Like, I don't know what happened there. I don't know if that was a glitch or what. So I only have a few fire bells, so we'll buy, oh, Jesus. Oh God, don't do it again. Okay, you know what? Just gone. I spent all my money, I'm poor, but I'm herb rich. And that's the important part, and dialogue. Oh, we're still working today. I thought, I thought that'd be the end of it. A strong, fast-acting poison? Well, I got something for you, man. I love how he's like, I'd appreciate it if you saved your questions. You know what, if you wanna kill somebody, as long as it's not my customer, I don't give a damn, dude, just pay me. So here we go, all aboard the potion train. Choo-choo, mother truckers. All right, enjoy killing whoever you wanted to kill, and holy crap, you must really wanna kill somebody for 103, hell yeah, dude. I shall take it. 109, okay, don't screw up, don't screw up, and done. 
118, I'm happy with that, considering I haven't upgraded haggling at all. All right, her husband managed to pinch his whittle hand. Here is your potion. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to throw it at you. Um, I gotta drop it there. 27? I, I thought it'd be worth way more. All right, well, that's fine. Oh, damn it. Oh, damn it! Oh my god. Oh, okay. This is embarrassing. Let's let's try and let's focus on the haggle. Focus on the haggle. It's okay. It's okay. Everything's going great, right? This, this is fine. Done, 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 done. I'm not gonna get better than that. We're back to 27. I'm so happy with that though, considering how much I screwed up. Summon to deal with an ice elemental tormenting a mountain village. An ordinary sword is useless against elementals, but if you can give it a fire potion, I'll coat my blade and take the elemental down. There is a question mark over here, so I guess we'll head that way and see what that is. This is actually called Fire Bell. If Fire is where Fire Bell goes, small details like that are fantastic. So I feel like if it's going to the left, fire has to be to the left as well. I think I'm just going to accept one. I know that's an ugly potion, but I'm more just curious what this is. Oh my god, it's fire. Here you go, good sir. Here is your fire. 19, not bad for a one star. Let's haggle still though, because... I want to get 20, damn it. Command sent me to fight an elemental too, but this one is a fire el elemental. He's gotten in the habit of str strolling through the wheat fields lately, starting fires. Do you have anything to cool him down? Well, that tells me if fire is over here, frost would be right over here, right? So that's got to be frost. Let's find out. And that is frost. Oh man, this game. I'm so excited for this game. Obviously, as I said, this is in development right now. So there's not a crazy amount of content yet, but there's definitely enough. Now the question is, do I want to go get this question mark? If I combine this with the frost, the client might not want it, but yes, you can combine things together obviously as well. I think I'll try it. We're just gonna do one, I don't really care. What was that? Sleep! Hey, he's cool with it. So that worked out very well because, uh. Yeah, I actually am gonna get more money because it's a more complex potion, so perfect, done. Kind of frustrating, I gotta be honest, I thought he healing potions would be worth a little more, especially three stars, but hey, it's good. 31, I'm happy, we got 300 in the bank. Reputation is excellent right now, so I am running a successful store. And I think that's it for the day, I'm not seeing any more customers. So what we're gonna do now, just because we still have some herbs left, let's make another one of these. We should, I think we need that downstairs. Yeah, we need three healths for this guy over here. Is that this one? Oh, the arrow down here. Okay, never mind. I think we're good. I think it goes in this one. Yeah, okay, so we gotta figure out this is poison. I might actually be able to make poison as well. Unfortunately, I do not have the ingredient for that mushroom. So it looks like you can have a max of five in every potion. So what I'd have to do is get a two star of one and a three star of another to get some of this done. Because, yeah, as you can see, some of these, like, yeah, this one's going to be real fun. Getting three different types. It should be doable, though. As long as we can find some of these and unlock them and get lots of herbs, I would love to try and get this done just to see what the hell this thing is. So, yeah, for right now, we'll just do that one for today, end our day, and uh, start a new day here. And we should have new customers. Like this great fellow. It looks like he probably sells me mushrooms. And would you look at the... God damn it, the red mushrooms are so expensive. Okay, done. I screw it, screw it. I don't even know if I, I gained anything. I, I freaked out there. Well, at least we got some mushrooms. Oh, I forgot to check my garden too. What do we got in the garden? Non-mushrooms. Okay, we got a little bit of mushrooms as well. We actually don't have much in the garden today, but that's okay. Because we're getting a nice collection of the basic ones at least, so that's good. Does this suck my potion in? I don't know what that does, but we did find something, so let's keep going. Hopefully I can get over that way because I want to see what this one is. Um, wow, like, the, just to, uh, to put reference, we are nowhere near the end of the map, so I'm assuming there's got to be so many potions out here. Oh, yeah! Give me something good. What is this? <gasps> Explosion! That's what we need for the map! Oh, this is going well. <laughs> the irony is they need a light source, and it's an explosive one. Yeah, he doesn't like that. I don't blame him. An explosive light, light source is not a good idea. Oh. I didn't even know I had a light potion, so that actually worked out. All right, another day of potion selling, and we got another good one here, so that's good. Let's see if we can haggle for a crazy amount right now. I'm feeling pretty confident. I still got some big ones, so there we go. Oh, skills, man. 71. I'm pretty damn happy with that. Okay, I'm running out of herbs, though, so I was hoping to get more of the alchemy done. 
I don't know if that'll be the case or not. So I could do maybe health and poison. Come on, give me one star. That's all I need. Perfect. It's exactly what I wanted. The worst poison ever because that's part of the job. So we need that in the spinny one. Perfect. We'll throw some poison in there. I think aside from that, I can't really do much of them right now because I need mostly poison and health. And I just, I cannot go to the left right now. So I really need to get lucky. Um, let's end today. We have a lot of money at least. So that's good. And hopefully tomorrow... We can get some more herbs from a salesman as well as, of course, in our garden as well. Thank God for the fire ones. Oh, more fire ones here. Sick. All right, so now we have a good selection for today. It should go well. Ooh, this one should be good. I think we found gunpowder already. So, um, yeah, this town passes through a cliff tunnel. When I went to town, everything was fine. On the way home, I found the tunnel blocked. Actually, before I do that, let me see if he'll accept this. Yes! I finally was able to sell it. Okay, well, I'm, I'm not mad about that then. Let's see if we can haggle this for a good price. This is the cool thing about this game though. Uh, obviously, the better the potion, the better the price. That was my best potion yet. What is this? Talk about lucky, isn't that what I needed? He needed uh, magical powers, mana. Uh, obviously, that's it, so we'll grab this XP and there's no sense going to get the other one because this is what this guy wants, so that worked out. Yes, 81 too, that's really good for a basic potion. Oh, and my final one for the day worked out because I got that mana potion and she needs strong magical power. So there you go, lady. Let's see if we can end off with a little bit more here. There, 89, way better. Let's see if we can at least add something to the, to the alchemy. So I need a two health and two poison. Come on, oh, that's not even close to a two, damn it. All right, that's where these come in handy, something like that. Just zigzag till we get a two. And there it is right there. Okay, so poison two. Or sorry, health two. A couple fires should be all we need to get over there and at least get part of the alchemy done. I don't know if we'll be able to get the alchemy done today, guys. This thing is insanely long, but it's a good challenge, and I'm curious to see what unlocks with this. And there we go. We got our two. I think it was two, two. I hope it was. Finish that potion, go down to the creepy basement. What do we have? It was somewhere here. Yes, I knew it. Okay, so it's that cauldron right there. So there we go, we got that. I mean, we got three. We need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine more. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's happening, guys, especially considering like this is the one I was talking about. I don't, we haven't found that yet. I think we found pretty much everything else because we got the, the spider web now, didn't we? No, we actually didn't. It was um, this thing. Okay, so we gotta find that as well. Okay, I've been exploring today. Um, that should work. I unfortunately used all my wind bloom though. I have I have two left, and that's the only easy way to go up. So obviously I don't wanna hit that. We're gonna back this up. I just wanna see what the hell this is, because I am pretty far away from main base, as you can see. I've been exploring this way. Trying to find the poison. I cannot find it. If this isn't poison, I'm gonna cry because this is by far the most I've spent on anything that's basic. Um, I gotta get... That should... That won't work because I can't pull towards that direction. Actually, that will work. Okay, which is mushroom again? Thank you. I'm gonna be very careful here to not royally screw up how far over. Okay, that should be good, I think. Nice and slow. That wasn't too slow, but that's fine. Three, please? Yes. Come on, please be poison. Bounce! Okay, I'm getting into the, like, really weird ones, and not even freaking close to a poison of any sort. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna have to say GG to the alchemy right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's ridiculous. All right, guys, and on that, I think we're gonna wrap up this episode here. I'm slowly working on my concoction here, but uh, yeah, we gotta figure out where the poison is before we uh, can even do this anyways. And we did a lot today. We unlocked the vast majority of the map, as you can see, but it's gonna get harder from here because we gotta go further away from the middle. But uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think of this game. I honestly love it. It's so unique. And I've always wanted to play like an interesting alchemy game where you actually have to brew, and I've never seen one any anywhere near as good as this. So yeah, if you don't know anything more about it, I'll have a link in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching and liking, and I'll see you in the next one.